dear students assalamu alaikum let us start with the lesson the topic is musa ali's camel from your sixth class english book let me know here can we name the four deserts of the world or can we name the places where camels are found or what about the or we can say what is the difference between the hot desert and the cold desert dear students Sama's father, a doctor by profession, was transferred from Srinagar to Nobra Valley in Ladakh. He asked his daughter to spend her summer vacation with him in Nobra. Both the father and the daughter stayed as paying guests at Dixit Dolma's house. Sama and Dolma became friends at very first sight and therefore Sama asked Dolma to tell her something about Nobra. Dolma said, Do you know that Ladakh is a desert? Sama said, Oh, you are kidding me. Dolma, no, no. It is true, Ladakh is known not only as a desert, but in fact, a cold desert. Sama, it is wonderful. I had heard only about the Sahara in Africa and the Thor in Rajasthan. Oh, it is thrilling to know that right now I am enjoying the magnificence. Magnificence of one of the most beautiful cold desert of the world dolma one more specialty is the camel in ladakh sama now you are kidding me again it is like a bald man carrying a bum or an eskimo enjoying an ice cream dolma no no i am telling you the truth I will arrange a meeting with Musa Ali on Sunday. Sama was very curious to know who this Musa Ali was. However, it was a bright Sunday morning and Sama was very happy because she had no other friends at Nobra. Sama and Dolma, after enjoying gurgur tea, and Mukmuk left for Musa Ali's house. Sama was surprised to see the camel cough in the company of a boy. Dexit Dolma, pointing towards the boy, said, Look, he is Musa Ali. After exchanging pleasantries, Dolma asked Musa Ali to tell them something about the bacterian camel. Musa Ali asked them to accompany him along with his camel cough into the vicinity of his village, the exit where a group of wild bacterian was present. Dear students, the bacterian camel is originally a native of Mongolia where it is called the uh, Haftakkai. However, it is also found in remote areas of the Gobi and Taklama Khan Desert in Mongolia and China, where it was heavily hunted for its hide and meat. It is interesting to know that most of the transport across the Karakaram and Silk Route was on the double hampered bacterian camel because of its outstanding performance on the mountains and desert trails. 
The bacterian camel is one of the best prepared mammals for the harsh extremes of the desert. Faced with the scorching heat, chilling cold and scarcity of food and water. Many animals struggle, but the wild hopkai faces all the odds. The camel can cover around 50 kilometers a day. The camel's long narrow nostril and dense eyelashes efficiently prevent damage from sandstorms. It sweets and urinates little, thus prolonging resistance to thirst. Thank you dear students.